All right, welcome back to Barrel Grain. We're back to day number five of Advent. We'll see what we got on the menu tonight. Number five. Oh, yeah, decent color. Decent dark yellow, amberish color. All right. All right. Number five. Man, already five days in. Ooh. A lot of fruit right off the bat. Heavy spice. Almost. Man, it smells good. This is real good. All right, let's get a little taste. I'll have some heavy baking spice on that one. Man, that thing smells delicious. Hmm. I mean, right out the gate, almost almost reminds me of like a Four Roses product. It's a heavy, heavy baking spice. All right, number five. Get bad boy out here. So I'm still thinking about 100 proof. It's not super high. A lot heavier spice on this one than some of the ones previous. Heavy fruit smell. Almost the heaviest, so it's almost reminds me of like a high rye bourbon. It's definitely not a weeder. Definitely a high rye. All right, so the clue is today. Crafted in limestone cellar, matured in French oak barrels, named for the number of staves, number of stave profiles. So limestone cellar, I was thinking of limestone distillery. Hmm. Matured in French oak barrels. Usually French oaks can give a nice soft, Wood oak tone. Mm. Name for the number of staves profile. Hmm. Yeah, what would that be? Number of stave profiles would make me think this is a, a maker's mark. Man, that does not seem to have the maker's mark are big on the stave profiles. I would love throwing the staves in there. Crafted in limestone cellar. Unless this is one of their like SAEs. So on. That'd be my guess. Man. Moving around just like whew. Makes you really start to think, you know, I mean, what you're drinking when you're dragging it in blind. Mm. See that in there, I did not get the heavy rye. This could be the 110 proof making up for it. But the number of staves profile. Crafted in limestone cellar, matured in French oak barrels. French oak barrels. Named for the number. Almost gotta be Maker's Mark. Hmm. Mm hmm. Well, let's go with my gut feeling. I'm not sure really if they're done in limestone cellars. That'd be something new I did not know. I think what else would be named over stave profiles that actually name the number that I would have. All right, let's go with the gut. Make it smart. Let's go with the gut. I'm guessing this is probably one of their limited releases, is my guess. Makers 46. So I was really close on that one. They'd probably give myself that one a win. 
Acres 46. I did not expect this to be a rye. Though. I thought this was more of a heavy rye. Rather than the weeded. You definitely get a lot more of the baked spice on this. The stay profile. That would make sense to make her big on the stay profile. Hmm. All right. So it's it for day five. And it is makers. That's really interesting. So I did not know they're actually finished in limestone cellars. Well, you learn something new every day. So this is day five of Advent. Thanks for stopping in. Like, comment, subscribe. In the meantime, keep hunting.